My name is Jim Vella. I'm president of the Ford Motor Company Fund and Community Services. My primary responsibilities include managing all of our community relations activities here in the U.S. and all of our philanthropic activities as well. I have a communications degree from the University of Detroit Mercy and I'm also teaching part-time at the University of Michigan Dearborn. My profession was somewhat chosen for me. I've had a long uh, history here at Ford Motor Company for 21 years. I started in television news, was there for 14 years. But kind of jobs come to you sometimes and, and you just happen to be in the right place at the right time. When I was asked to take this job as president of the Ford Motor Company Fund, I was actually teaching on a loan executive program at the University of Michigan Dearborn and this opportunity came up and it really was something I was passionate about so I was very eager to accept the role. While there are a ton of resources that are available out there for students who want to learn more about being in philanthropy or volunteerism or any of those things, first of all, they can go and Google it and they can find out a lot of websites like the Ford website, the Michigan.gov website where we have a Mentor Michigan program, Serve Michigan program. They can learn about volunteer activities in their community just by reading the local newspapers. They can also go to their college campuses. Most of our college campuses today have a very active volunteer community service program. Some have classes actually that teach how to become involved in nonprofits. So there are a lot of resources out there. All they really have to do is open their eyes and look around. I think it's very important for students to be involved in their communities for a couple of reasons early on in particular. One is that it's really the way the business world is going. This isn't something, uh, volunteerism and philanthropy isn't something that you can just do sometimes as a corporate leader. You have to do it all the time. The sooner you start to learn those skills and start to adapt them into your daily life, the better you'll be later in life. And second, I think it's just another great experience for young people to work together in teams with very limited resources, which they will learn to do in the corporate world. So it's a great exercise in preparing themselves for what's to come. My first job was working in a grocery store for my father. And your dad's probably your toughest boss that you ever have in life, because you really can't talk back to him. So he really, and he knows everything. So I really learned the basics of business through working at a small entrepreneurial organization, a small grocery store. And I think it's really helped me through the rest of my life. My first, what I call real job in life was working at Channel 2 here in Detroit as an intern. And that one really taught me three things. One is how to make coffee. The second is how to learn. I was really, I was a reporter's assistant and so I got to learn from really top-notch professionals about how to organize a day, how to work on deadline, how to do all those things. And third, it really opened my eyes to the challenges that were out there in the business world and that you had to be really good at what you were going to do no matter what you chose to do if you were going to be successful. First of all, they need a good college education. I think the students who are exploring my field need a good, solid college education, one that's very broad in nature. They need to know how to run a business, they need to know how to communicate, and most importantly, they need to know how to learn. Because a lot of students believe that once they get off that college campus, they know it all, they're done learning. But really, it's only the start of a long journey in their life. So I think having that strong foundation and then being a student of the world, in whatever world they choose to go into, whether it's the nonprofit world, the business world, political science, whatever, they really have to become a student of the area that they want to go into. In my position, I'm responsible for a lot of different things, including all of our community relations activity and all of our philanthropy. One of my, my favorite things to do is to get out with our employees working on volunteer projects. So we have accelerated action days here at Ford where our employees go out and work with our nonprofit partners, whether it's in the Hispanic community or mentoring students or whatever we choose to do or whatever they choose to do. And it really is what Ford is all about in terms of, we're not just about writing checks. There really is a heart behind the oval here and it beats in the hearts of all of our employees. And that's what I think makes this job so special and different from other corporate foundation jobs. Mm -hmm.